Why did I eat so much food? Well, we're back. Warning. This program contains coarse humor and a sense of language that some people might not share. Viewer discretion is advised. What the hell was I thinking? All right. Well, oh, hello. Hold on. Mixer. Why does Mixer always freaking crick me up the ass? Mixer. Stop doing it. Why? You do this, Mixer. Twitch? No, don't jump in, Twitch. Okay. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna hope... Against hope here that maybe... Maybe this is working. Damn. I ate way too much for lunch today. I had a couple of potatoes in the fridge that were spoiling. So I just made whatever out of them. And, uh... That was way more potatoes than I should have ate. Oh my god. Okay. Today's drink of the day doesn't exist because I was running a little bit behind and I didn't actually prepare a drink of the day. So, there is no drink of the day. <clears throat> Forget what I was up to last time, but... Here we've got the cacti. And over here we've got the... To the whatever farm. Okay, so I don't know what I was planning to do today. I don't really have a plan. But there's been like... Friggin' police officers everywhere today. I don't know what's going on. Whether something maybe happened or whatever. But it's like... It's like friggin' everywhere. Right? I get on the elevator, there's police. I get off the elevator, there's even more. I don't know if like maybe somebody did something and they're investigating the, like the area or what the hell's going on but it's just kind of creepy boy I don't know don't know what else to say oh here's what we were doing we were trying to provoke the uh, the illagers hello we were trying to provoke the illagers because uh, last episode we did the Woodland Explorers map, and we tried to find it, but we didn't. We didn't find it. Well, I messaged Timmy to just give him, to just ask him if he could give us like a, like a basic idea of how far away it is. And uh, oh, the, this is his response: twenty-one thousand blocks. Twenty-one thousand blocks away. That's how far away that stupid mansion is. So that's gonna be like a hell of a walk. I don't think I'm gonna do that. It's not a rule. It's just saying. It's just saying no. Hold on. What do we got here? Let's see. Those paying attention to my uh, my follow count will notice that it mysteriously dropped by like three or four people. That wasn't three or four people unsubscribing, that was me messaging the Twitch mods and saying, why the hell do I have bots following me? Get rid of them. So uh, Twitch deleted a couple of bots and uh, that was pretty good. I'm actually happy that they're gone, because I don't like false viewers giving me hope. <clears throat> Damn, my throat is just wrecked today. Maybe it's because I ate so much potato. Or maybe it's because there was something wrong with those. You're not disappearing this time, horse. I got my eye on you. You're not going nowhere. So yeah, we gotta find some illagers and we gotta take them out. That's the goal of the episode. So if we can do that, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Would there still be illagers in the Nether? Like from that time that I 
that I blasted those illagers into the nether. Would they still be there? Because if so... Ho, 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 ho. We can use that to our advantage, Mushka. Let's go take a look. To the nether. Strength potions, health potion. Please tell me there's at least one of them. I need to start an illager raid. I don't see him. Crap. Well, where's the leader? He was here not too long ago. Crap, they all despawned. No, the illagers, uh... Illagers all despawned. How depressing. Alright, well... I guess it is what it is, but I was really hoping to, uh... To find some illagers in the nether, because that's where we left them. But I guess that they despawned, so... Is what it is... Since we're here, we might as well get some quartz. I just want to get some soul sand. Oh, hello. Okay, can we safely... No, we cannot. There's nothing safe about this. Um... Ouch. Hello. I'm here for quartz. Ah, yes. The quartz. We are all here for the quartz. They say the quartz is the number one way to gain XP in Minecraft, so that's pretty cool. Ah, yes, more of the quartz. I'm intentionally mispronouncing it, because that's cute. Dang, it has been one hell of a week, I tell you. Oh, thank you so much, game, for the lag. Apparently, Timmy is planning to retire. I don't know what that means for the, uh, for the Minecraft server. It might mean nothing. But it might mean that uh, 404 Island might not be online anymore, possibly. So that's something to consider. That's stuff that's happening. <coughs> God damn my throat, man. If anyone ever asks you if you want to eat two massive oversized potatoes, I tell you, the answer is probably going to be yes, but take that with some caution. I bet I can get him. Single shot from a... Where'd he go? Single shot from a power four bow would take him down instant. I tell you, it, there he is. There's the bastard. Okay. Get over here, bastard. what I tell you? Single shot. Oh, crap. That's where I was. Like hell, I'm going down there to pick up his crap. <clears throat> Drop anything I can use up here. Tell me. Come on. I need a gas tier. That gives you regen potions. That's useless. I bet his tier dropped down there. Damn. Hell if I'm going to get it. There's another. I hear another gas. Where is the other ghast? I want... I want a tear. I want to make him cry. Oh, we need soul sand. I think. 
Oh god, how am I gonna get over there? Hold on. Okay, that's not terrifying. Um, hold on, can I? I can snipe them from here, definitely. But should I? Yes. All right, we kicked him in the nads. Uh, his stuff is over there. I like how I turned around on that so far, so fast. I'm just like. Is it really okay to take out this ghast? And then two seconds later, yep, we're doing it. You drop anything for me? Where was that soul sand? What was I looking at? I was. It's up there, isn't it? All right, let's go. This isn't soul sand. What the hell? What was I looking at then? I saw soul sand. Oh, it's down. Oh dear. We've got to be able to go down. We can do it. Oh my. This is not a good thing. I think it is perhaps a little bit sketchy. Uh, no lava, please. Just straight down. Okay, no large drops, please. Just straight down. Okay, that's pretty close. Come on, gas tier, gas tier, anywhere. I see not a, a gas tier. Should have kicked his ass with the uh, looting sword. You can't get looting on a bow, can you? I'm assuming the answer is no. It'd be pretty cool if you could. All right. Well, I got what I came here for. I'm gonna get back. Uh, I guess I should go up. Alrighty. So I'm thinking of doing a live stream of me drawing. Like a drawing live stream. Just be like, yo guys, I'm making some art. And I have to emphasize that it's art. And, uh, and in addition to emphasizing that it's art, I need to put boobs in the title. And if I do that, then I'm sure that my viewership count is going to go, like, skyrocketing. Just absolutely skyrocketing. Because that's just, that's how it works on uh, YouTube, Twitch, anywhere, really. Is, uh, the word boobs gets a crap ton of views, whereas, you know, balls doesn't get nearly as many. Let's see here. There we go, six ender pearls. We got these three. We got nine ender pearls. I think we need 12 to make it to the end, so we're getting close. Getting close to the ender game there, eh? Hey, cookie. So, how does this stuff work? Let's just. Let's just give this a shot. Wow. Look at that. Hey. You can't fight against this, can you? I don't think you can... No, you can't fight against it. It's too quick. That's cool. I like how it bounces you out. That's that's really... I'm going to try swimming with it. Go. Give me. Come on, bubbles, keep pushing me up. No? 
Not gonna work. Hey, Scully Horse! What are you doing underwater? Alright. So we got some friggin... No, I don't need to take this horse. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to make use of my underwater base, wherever the hell that is. It's somewhere over here. Oh, hello. We're gonna go underwater. We're gonna take care of Le Busy Nas. Le Busy Nas. Where is it? At night, I should be able to. There it is. See it a lot more clearly. Here we go. Right? See what I mean? Check it. Check it. Check, 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 check. Check one, two. Check one, two. All right, here we go. This is what we want. Uh, no. Did I tell you to descend? Nidus. Hi. All right. So we're just going to let the water come down. Then we're going to put the soul sand at the bottom. And that'll be like an elevator to excellence. Wow, this actually holds it back. All right, here we go. No, what are you... Why? How? Where did that become a thing in here? How did it do that? Okay, well, lucky thing I have that blocked off then, eh? Here, let's, let's just do some, uh... Alright. All clear. Oh, crap. I'm gonna have to mine this down, aren't I? Hold on. I guess that's not a big deal. And then we soul sand it. Now, I think for this to actually work, you need to plant kelp on it, and then, you, or you need the water to be, like, not flowing. <laughs> oh, wow, that was a hiccup. Okay. Um, hold on. There we go. We can make an infinite water source. Not like that, but like this. If we do that, all right, so that makes it an infinite water source, but that only gets us this far. That only gets us a little bit. So we need to uh, need to keep filling it in as we go. Oh, damn. This is going to be tough. It's going to spill out now, isn't it? Yeah, it is. See? How am I going to hold this? Oh, well, i got plenty of doors. I'll hold it back with doors. Because we can. No, you don't, water. No! No, you don't, I say. There. Now, how are you going to flow? No idea how that would... Whoa, hello. All right, this method works. Check this out. So we're going to just keep... dumping water. Ah, crap. Crap on a pancake brick. Uh, pancake brick. Right, we just got to keep... Pushing that up. And we need something over top of the doors, too, I suppose. There we go. I mean, we could just walk in from the side, can't we? Oh. But there exists a problem. Because we don't want these to be just going up. We want some of these to be going down, don't we? This isn't just an escape. There has to be, there has to be an entrance as well. Oh dear, what I gonna do?
I think this is working. How do I, how far to, up does it have to go? I think that's how far it needs to go. Oh no, it stops here. Crap, quit. Go higher. Okay, that went a bit higher. All right, we're so close, buddy. We're like... All right! Yo, check it out. All right, we'll never lose that again. Now, how does this work with boats? If I, if I ride a boat over it, is it going to go down? Wow. Fireworks. That's pretty cool. Okay, so now if I, if I build a second one then. It's going to have to be like right next to it. But this one's going to be descending. The undescended times. Let's go. All right. This will be the descending node. And for this I shall require magma blocks. Crap, this isn't going to end well, is it? I'll probably drown, and then I'll realize that there was probably a better way to go about doing this. Man, this helmet is awesome, this aqua affinity thing. Just absolutely could not recommend more. Alright, let's put down some more torches. You know what, that torch is going to get destroyed in that location. Let's see, how are we going to do this? We need those magma thingies too, eh? So this side is going to be ascending. No, descending. Hey, check it. All right, so there's the door holding back the water. We're going to need another door here. Another set of double doors, actually. Oh no! Uh, I don't have another! Crap! I do have a crapping table. Crapping table set up specifically for the event that I crap. There we go. Do I have any... Do I have, I have gold? Come on. Gold is a terrible... Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I don't have any wood. But I tell you what we do have. We have a lightning fast way to get back to the surface so that we can gather the materials we need. Look at how these doors hold back the water. Simply impressive. Let me back in this boat. Come on, let's go. All right. Let's get us some materials. That was actually pretty cool. The whole thingy-do, whatever you call it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like that. I don't like that I lost my pickaxe. That's... I like Minecraft's uh, Feed the Beast mod, where you can do like, you can do like individual, like if you want to add sharpness to a sword, you can put quartz on it. Dried kelp. 20 of dried kelp. Why do I want to say quelp? Alright, now this, this is, uh, this has been a little 
bit of time in the plan and get rid of that stupid shovel. It's not worth anything. All right, so we got all this kelp, right? And we got all this quartz, which I guess I can get rid of now. And we got this stuff. But the, the big idea is we got this kelp. How are we going to cook all the kelp? It's self-sustaining, that's how. Okay, there's no more than that. Get this back in here. As well as these two cooked ones. So here's what's going to happen. This is going to go for 32. 32 ticks. After which we're going to have... Or no, 32, 32 per. After that, we're going to have a lot of this stuff. We're going to have a lot of kelp. A lot of dried kelp. We got one stick. Come on. We got the nep gear. I'm not going to use the nep gear to mine this. Uh, but we need something. What are they going to do? Uh, hey, we got name tags. Why didn't anyone tell me? Okay, that's nice. And another totem of undying, I know that much. Uh, I just need to grab some additional resources then, don't I? Look out, skeleton horse. I need to get wood. There we go. We've got magma blocks. Nice. That time I went to the nether and I picked them up. Oh, not knowing what they were, but they will be very useful now. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Do I not have iron? I not have iron. Well, now what I do? Wait, 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 wait. I see a furnace. I see a furnace with nothing of use. Okay. Good to know. At least we tried. Give me pickaxe. Or give me death. Alright, we got pickaxe, we got magma blocks, we got empty bucket. This should be all that we need to make our dream a reality. So the big bi the big the big the big wide world of computational fluid dynamics simulations is large and complicated. And the particular one that I'm working on, unfortunately, nobody has ever done before. Such is life in higher education. You have to be Whoa, stupid dolphins! St Hold on, can I can I use luck of the dolphin to get, get past this? No, I can't. Okay. Okay, I really But I mean, like, the, the research I'm doing is pretty damn interesting. It's like... It's just difficult. Which makes everything difficult. It's like... Whoa. It's like you gotta, you gotta figure out how to solve this stuff because it's part of the requirement of, uh, of getting a degree. But it's like, no one's ever done it before and it's really high-level difficult math. But I seem to be getting some progress. And when I say some, notice how I'm dragging out the M a lot. There's only so much progress to be had. And it is with regrets that uh, sometimes you just gotta realize that you're- OH! Okay, well thank you. <laughs> I guess so. Let's- let us see. May we? You're not dragging me down. Where's the zombie dude? I want to see if I can get him sucked into this. There he is. Look at him watching me. He's just a watcher. He's like... I know what's going on down there. <laughs> Whoa! Bye-bye, zombie. Hello, zombie. Wow, there's more than one. Come on, you guys. Get down here. This is some cool stuff. You're really missing out on it. I swear. Ow. 
I swear you're gonna want to see this. Alright, is that good enough? How high does this go? Okay, wow, I think it goes up to the surface now. Does it? It does! Alright, so we got one that pushes you up, and the one right next to it pulls you in. Alright, we got our elevator. Hey, come here! Come here, guy! Oh, crap. I can't, I can't! Ah! Come on, you! Oh! What you gonna do? Oh, hello. Look at these guys. They're so slow. They can't they can't even get me. Look at this. I'm invincible. I can stand right here for the rest of eternity. And all these guys can do is stroke their doll. Stroke their doll. I wanna say stroke their nads, but you get the idea. You get the picture. Hey you! Come here. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to push you this way and this way. Come on, get in that get in that bubble stream. Come on. There, that's what I'm talking. <laughs> that was great. Oh, that was great. That was that was exactly what I wanted to see. Bye-bye. All right, let's get this guy. Let's get this guy. Let's kick him in the nuts. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Come on, get in that bubble stream, boy. You get in that bubble stream. Go on. Yeah, look at that. Shot up into the air. What's he got in his hand? Oh, he's got cobblestone. It's a manor. Whoa, hello. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Come and get me. Come and get me, bro. Ooh. Hello. These guys drop gold? Whoa, 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 whoa! Let me get, let me get, let me get some of this here. These guys drop gold. Where'd he go? How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, shoot. No, no, no! Let me out. Oh God. Yeah, this is gonna be a big problem, I think. Okay, there we go. Where'd this guy go? So wait. Did he maybe burn to death on this? Hmm. I think it seems very possible. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me, let me, I don't know. I want to move these doors so I can get out. Oh, crap. Talk about uh, the wrong move. Wait, there's gold under there. Yeehaw! There's gold in them there mines. Let's go, let's go. Why did I get rid of the shovel? Color me genius. Alright, so this is where I need to be able to get out from. Oh, why did I move my arm? Ah. Alright, then we'll put down the doors after we mine the gold. We can't mine gold with this. We'll have to mine the gold later. Right? I am correct in saying we can't mine gold with with uh, this pickaxe. Am I not? Ow, give me a break. Give me a break. No. No. I break it. There. This one, this one still does. Oh, that one works. Okay. Fair enough. Stop burning me. All right. So here we go. This is the descending. This is the ass ending. Whoa, look at that. Dude, that's pretty sick. Now, here is another idea that I have. If we go back to the nether and just collect as many of those magma blocks as we can, we can make an ocean with a false surface. By which I mean everything will sink. Where are my boots, anyway? My boots are not doing so great. Thank you for asking. 
we're gonna make well let's let's just let's just see what we can get for now but I want to make something that's like where's the rest of those? We've got the village, but the defense in the village is really kind of, eh, I'd say questionable. But what? Put this in here. Uh, where's the rest of those magma blocks? Hold on, I think I remember where I put them. What if we got a ton of magma blocks? And just spam them all around the outside of the village so that anything trying to get to the village has to cross over literal magma. Liquid hot magma. Okay. It's from uh, Austin Powers. Austin Powers. I remember when I was a kid, that was like, that was the best movie, I tell ya. Uh, when I was a kid, we always used to turn up the volume to absolute maximum at the point where he says, We're in a volcano. We're surrounded by liquid hot magma. <laughs> so, you know, when my parents are sleeping in after working nights on a 12-hour shift, and you just crank that sucker at liquid hot magma. You gotta take off pretty quick. Head for the head for the basement. Head for cover, cause you know you're gonna get yelled at. Oh, <laughs> uh, but it was worth it. I tell you, totally worth it. Liquid hot magma. That was uh, Austin Powers, like the best when I was a kid. I just loved that movie. I mean, there's some question as to whether kids should be watching that, but I mean. Whatever. I had fun. I was 12. I enjoyed it. Well, that was efficient. One of those movies that really defines you as a kid, you know? I don't know. I don't know if anyone else has as fond of feelings about watching Austin Powers when they were a kid, but I... I don't know. Mike Myers, he's a good actor. We got a Piper Dune! <laughs> oh, we got a Piper Dune. Now, will this start fires? Because I hope not. If I lay this down around the village, that should be... should be what it is. See, the whole reason we're doing this, if the illagers show up, that's going to hurt them. Right? So we got this we got this fence and everything, and that's a defense. But we're going to encircle the defense with an O fence, and the O fence is going to be these magma blocks, which look all well and, you know, harmless and whatever. But in reality... I might have to go to the nether to collect more of these. This is going to help ward off any kind of pillager invasion. I won't put these right next to the fence, though, because I don't know how the fire thing works with the fence. Especially with these being magma blocks. But I kind of, I like this idea. I like this idea of just surrounding the defense with an offense. Thus inhibiting the spread of the pillagers. If I put these under the boat, do you think the pig is going to burn? I'm not really apt to test that, but I, I could. Okay, here we go. Don't burn, little piggy. This here's the pink village for a reason. Not the black village. Oh, God. The black village. 
I can imagine somebody making the Black Village in Minecraft. In today's political climate, that would be political suicide. Yeah, we need more magma cubes. We really need more magma cubes. Let's go get some magma. To the nether! To the Netherlands, to the Netherlands, to the Netherlands where they've got fire. Yeah, the Netherlands, to the Netherlands, because the Netherlands, they've got fire. Alright. Anything else that happened this week? I don't think so. I ate friggin'... It was only two potatoes, but they were the weight and size of four standard potatoes. That's what I had for lunch. That's why I was complaining when I started the stream. I'm like, oh my god, why did I eat so much? But uh, don't worry, I'm not going to gain any weight because I seem to be stuck at the current weight that I'm at. No matter what I eat, if I don't eat or if I do eat, I'm stuck at the same weight. So I'll be fine. But, uh, tis what it is. To the nether. To the nether. Where we'll get some magma blocks. I really want to... Really want to do the, the pillagers. I really want to fight off some pillagers this episode. But unfortunately, they ain't playing game. We haven't had a single pillager show up. Alright, let's try to leave here with a full stack of 64. Crap, how am I going to get these? Uh, there's a whole bunch of them down here. Alright, full stack of 64. I should have brought some fire res. Whoa, hello. Fire resistance potions, you know? Okay, this uh, this platform, methinks, is not entirely safe. Luckily, I've been here before. As evidenced by the torches I doth placed. All right, don't worry about me, pigmen. I'm just stealing. Oh, that's so cute. Look at that. How deep does this go? I gotta pick these up, you know. Okay, good. Okay, gotta be careful here, cause, you know, magma cubes, lava, seems like a natural combination. Whoa, dude, there's a whole underground system here. Cherry. That's just rocking, mate. Look at that. I could pee down here. And no one will be able to see me. Whoa. Talk about crazy. Hey, I just had an idea. If I travel, like, 1,100 blocks in the nether, then that's got to be at least 2,000 blocks on the surface. So maybe then I could get to that, to that uh, temple-y place, the woodland mansion. All I gotta do is travel through the nether to get there. That'd work, wouldn't it? Wow, I gotta really be careful here. This is how everybody dies in the nether. Mining walls on the same level as where they're standing. Okay, good, thank you. That means I have to leave. I've got no choice. This is literally, this is how everyone dies in the nether. They're mining into a wall and lava starts pouring out. What do you do? There's nothing you can do. You can't get no water. If you don't have a fire resistance potion on you, you're done. You're done, son. Can I plant a cactus in the nether? That'd be so cool. Oh, good gravy, Marie. Good gravy, Marie. Get back, you. Back, I say. Back! Oh no! He's gonna kill me! He's strong! He's strong! Oh my god, these are all these are all high-level bosses right here. Holy crap! Holy crap and a pancake brick. Okay, let's take him. Let's take him. You! 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 And you! You! 
Ouchie. All right, we got some. We got we got nine. Okay, speaking of fire resistance, well, I can't I can't hit them. They got a dude right next to them. If I hit them, I'm gonna hit the pigman. If I hit the pigman, I'm dead. Switch tactics. Precision. Yes, the axe is a weapon. It's a precision weapon when you're in the vicinity of friendly mobs that will turn hostile at any second. Alright, there we go. Lovely. Nine magma creams. Wow. You know, if I had gotten those remaining magma, magma cubes with the looting sword, then I would have been, like, on easy street. But I think with nine, that gives us, what, nine times three is 27. Gives us potential for 27 fire resistance potions. I think I can live with 27 fire res potions. I think that'll work. Okay, is there no way to get these stupid sea cucumbers to grow? They've just been sitting there piddling around. They ain't been growing. So, like, plant, grow. <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful sight, beautiful sight. Plenty of magma blocks. Let me out of here. Okay. So, here's the thing I notice these have not grown. Come on, give me these pickles. Alright. How are we going to do this? We're going to put these over here and hope that they grow vertical. Because I'm thinking maybe it's just like... The surface of the water is too close and maybe that's why they're not growing. But at the same time, it might not be the case. Where's my horse? So anyway, there is a potential on the YouTube that I might upload some drawing videos of me drawing various characters from anime and manga. I am not very good at right where I am right now. I'm not very good. But that's why you practice. So potentially in the future, we may see that. Uh, we're out. Ooh, give me bread. Oh, man, why am I tired? Okay, so, yeah, we'll plant down the rest of the O-fence. Once the O-fence is set, then we're good. The O-fence is the best way to protect against an illager invasion, I swear. All right, let's move it over here. Surround the village with the offense. Should I go under the cactus farm? Probably not, right? Because we gotta we gotta build walls on that and house civilians and whatnot. Fair enough, I doth say. Get this crap out of here. Get out of here, pig. What do you think you're doing? You're gonna burn to death on these these here magma block. Here, this is what I mean by you're going to burn to death, Mr. Pig. Tell me I didn't try to stop you. What? Ah, see what I mean? That's what I'm, that's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Stop walking around it. You're avoiding the issue. Come on. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ow. Stupid pig. He injured me. He's so smart. Well, if the pig can avoid it, then maybe the uh, maybe the illagers can too, eh? So I guess there's uh, there's that perspective. Maybe this offense is not going to be as effective as I thought. That's where you have cactuses, though, right? Oh, that was a bad decision. That was a bad decision. 
What am I thinking? That was a bad decision. Okay, let's go. I was looking up this uh, this video game called Nightmare Ned. It's one of those games that used to come in the bottom of like a crappy cereal box. But it was actually a decent game. I was trying to see if I could find a copy of it because I figured that'd be fun to play again from like a modern video game perspective. It was like a Tim Burton style animation, like a cell animation kind of game. And it was kind of, it was well entertaining. Uh, you know, considering that it came free with a box of Cheerios. So, yeah, I was trying to look that up to see if I could uh, try playing it on stream. I can't seem to find a copy of Nightmare Ned, so if anybody knows somebody who saved a crappy video game from their box of cereal when they were a kid, maybe consider copying it and sending a copy over to me. I don't know. I can't say that officially, but you know. Nightmare Ned. I really did like the uh, kind of the cell animation, almost an homage to Tim Burton. It was a very interesting game, I dare say. Well, that magma block's just gonna sit there forever. All right, so our offense is starting to take off. Look at that. All around the city, we have the offense. Who dares to cross the offense of the pink village? I love that this is the pink village and it's all, you know, pink and happy and whatever. Meanwhile, the methods of defending against attackers is like severely barbaric. I want to say barbaric. It seems like it is. Because it's like you get too close to the village, they're just going to burn you to death. But yeah, you got to imagine that the uh, the mobs probably have some built-in, you know, into their pathfinder, avoid the magma blocks type of deal. I don't know. Feels like they ought to. And yet I'm still doing this. Why? I don't know. But there could be a reason. Who knows, maybe maybe it actually works to some extent. Yeah, magma block right next to wood. That seems like a, a stellar idea right there. Alright. Yeah, this is uh this is about what we got then, I guess. Um Yeah. Crap, I'm going to sneeze. Eh. <coughs> oh, man. That. That sneeze just went everywhere. Holy crap. Oof. I don't always sneeze. But when I do, holy crap, do I ever sneeze. Come here. Oh dear. I nearly just put down a magma block in front of this guy's face. He would have been so sad. There's my horse. Okay, so we're protected against illagers in every way, shape, and form. Look at this. How are you going to get to the village now, illagers? There's friggin' magma blocks. Like, everywhere. Look at this. How are you going to get over the magma blocks, villagers? How are you going to get over them? I suppose logically you could just walk around them. Dude, should I like make it impossible? I could literally do that. 
I could literally put like I'd have to go back to the nether and collect some more, but I could I could make these all connected. We could make it work. See so you do this. Check it. See? Just connect them all. Dude, we could so do that. It's a terrifying as hell concept for the village because it means that, like... It means that if the pillagers show up, they're going to have to navigate around liquid... Or not liquid hot, but... Solid magma cubes all around the village. Oh, God. I didn't realize he would get stuck on that so easily. Okay, well that's that fares well for the uh, for the offense. I'm gonna get some more magma clop, magma clop. What is with my speech today? Ugh. The past few weeks I've been pretty well on point with my speech, and I haven't been messing up so much. But today, dang, today I've just been, I've been messing, messing syllables all over the place, like, I don't know what happened. I have no idea what happened, I'm just suddenly, today, mixing my syllables all over the place. Last week I've been fine. Well, it's a long weekend. I have a extra time to figure it out. That's why I'm thinking about uh, doing a drawing live. Well, not live. Doing a drawing time lapse video. Uploading it to my YouTube channel because I think because that's you know I'm I'm a guy, so you know I don't really benefit from having you know, stuff in the thumbnail, if you, if you know what I mean. But I can draw stuff and thus make a thumbnail including, you know what I mean, right? What is the number one most clicked thumbnail on YouTube? Or Twitch, for that matter. Or Mixer. Or that funny thing with the green dude. The most clicked thumbnail. Everyone knows. Which is why it's kind of hard for guys to get started a lot of times. But, if you know how to draw, then you can get some good, uh, you can get some good thumbnails if you know how to draw. That's what I'm going to be looking to do, hopefully. I... You know, is it moral? No. But since when have I been about morals? No one's ever been moral to me. Holy crap, look at this. This place is incredible. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to mine up this crap. Right? So we go here, if we just start mining from here, we can mine all of this. Like it don't even matter. Like it don't even matter. All the magma cubes, all the magma cubes, gonna put a perimeter around the city. Ain't nobody gonna step. Ain't nobody gonna step. Let's step on magma, let's step on magma, gonna set up a drawbridge, yeah. You can do a drawbridge on Minecraft, right? I'm pretty sure you can. So if we do a drawbridge over like a magma cube or a magma block pit, ain't no illagers getting past a magma block pit, I tell you what. Magma blocks, magma blocks, get myself some magma blocks. Oh yeah. Look at that. 
At least two stacks of 64, I figure. But I might go for more. I'm undecided. I'll get back to you on that. Oh, I hear a magma cube. Ah, oh, so sad. What do I got anyway? I got almost two stacks of 64. So we're just going to go till we run out of this pickaxe. Okay, I definitely hear a magma cube. Ow! Stop doing that. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yo, Maggie. Come here, Maggie. Come on. Come here, Maggie. I see ya. That's his new name. His name is Maggie. Maggie the magma cube. Come on, y'all. Give me some Maggies. More Maggies. Ah, here's ya. Hey, get back, you. I've asked ye. I've asked ye to get back. Come on, this is a looting sword. Where's my damn magma cream? Did I, I didn't get a single magma cream out of that? You're joking me. You gotta be joking, Hadoken. Not one? With a looting sword? Looting three? And I didn't get a single magma cream. Wow. And last time I got nine. Wellity, wellity, wellity. Wellity? Simpsons reference. Man, is the Simpsons still running? I don't even know. Are they still... Are the Simpsons still airing? I don't think so. Because I think they stopped because people realized that they were just turning the entire show into a piece of crap that nobody wanted to watch. So I think that they stopped airing, didn't they? Though I may be mistaken on that. I'm not 100% certain. I don't know. I would be... I suppose I should be mistaken for thinking so, at least. I don't know anybody who watches The Simpsons still, so they could be completed airing, and I just don't know about it. I miss the good old days, though. When they were still good, you know? My, uh, my aunt a few years ago was like... She heard that uh, that me and my siblings watched The Simpsons, and she was like shocked. She's like, "Oh my God, you let them watch that!" Um, but fast forward about two years later, right? I was, you know, I was, I think, twelve or thirteen when I was watching The Simpsons. Well, fast forward a couple of years. And my uh, my ten year old cousin is watching Family Guy, and this is the same person who was shocked that a twelve year old was watching The Simpsons. She's like, "What? Family Guy is a family show. It's in the title." Really? Anywho, yeah, that's. Uh, that was an interesting one. But people say, oh, it's it's different time now. It's a different time, so things have changed. It's like, well, not a hell of a lot has actually changed. It's just there's no way for you to escape it. It's going to find you one way or the other. If you go on the internet, you're going to find it. It's a, it's a damn meme. If you look up the Pepperidge, Pepperidge Farms meme... It's like, it's there. There's no escaping it. Oh, wow. Yo ho, Fromaggio. Let's go. Hello. Let's get these guys. Get them. Get them. Ah. Stay there, horse.
All right, what did we get? We got some pants. Are these pants useful? I want the bones. I guess I do want the bones. Hold on. Make sure there's no creepers coming up on us here. Okay, unbreaking boots that you're mostly broken. We got golden leggings. We can we can probably farm this stuff for like. I think if you put them into a uh, into a furnace, you get nuggets and stuff. So that'll work. Let's away. Yeah, I'm gonna need some kind of drawbridge. Something simple I can just rake my horse over or whatever. And not get, you know, burnt by magma. Alright, let's burn these leggings. Turn them into something we can use. Where's the furnace? Oi. Where is mine furnace? I have a furnace. That's just, that's a smoker. That one's a loom. Do I not have a furnace here? I'm sure I do. That's a smoker. Is the furnace upstairs? Yes, it is. There we go. Oh, wow. 29 stone. I don't need it. Thank you. Yes, I knew it. As for the unbreaking boots, I don't know if the enchantment's going to give us anything. But I should hope. <laughs> a single golden nugget from... Uh... Hey, I'll take it, though. I'll take it. It's better than receiving zero golden nuggets. Where did my shovel go? I thought I just made an iron spade. What the hell happened to it? Ah... Uh... Am I perhaps mistaken? Did I not make an iron spade? I thought I did. Maybe I left it in the nether. Oh well. Alright, here we go, here we go. So we're gonna, we're actually gonna connect all of these, I suppose. Good luck trying to break into the city now, mobs. <laughs> cannot get past my magma cube defenses. I guess this isn't offensive. A defense is meant to be like a passive barrier. An offense or an offense is something that's like you're taking the offensive, you're fighting back kind of deal. And that's what this is. The friggin... O fence, also known as the magma block. Hey, does anybody actually watch these? This is to the YouTube people, because I keep getting like. YouTube says that there's a view count of more than zero. The only thing is, people have been watching the YouTube ones for like five or six seconds. Which leaves me to wonder, you know, is there on YouTube actual viewers? I have my doubts. So if there is any viewers on YouTube, then comment on the video. Bork plaster. And, uh, and I'll consider it a win. That's right, if you watch the YouTube videos, go now and comment Bork Plaster. Bork Plaster in that exact expression. And, uh, yeah. You'll receive the nod of approval of the 404 guy. A very rare thing, the nod of approval. Or typically, I nod in disapproval. It's going to be funny, because this week, if anybody if anybody actually comments that, I'm gonna, just going to look at it, and I'm going to be like, what the heck is this person doing? And then I'll be like, oh yeah, now I remember. Bork plaster. Bork plaster of the 21st century. Oh, 
Also comment if you want to see a, a manga type style drawing tutorial. Because I will consider doing so. That's I have to I have to realize that I am severely anemic in my commentaries and perhaps people would be more interested in watching me draw with polite music in the background. Indeed it is possible. I think what I really gotta do is I gotta pick up some new simulator games. It's been such a long time since I played something new. And uh, simulator games are my forte extreme. I was thinking of, uh, of playing Prison Architect Simulator. It's like 30 bucks. Like holy crap. What indie games are like 30 bucks these days? That's friggin' some expensive stuffs right there. And the reviews I see on it, people have been having issues with bugs and whatever. Which leads me to wonder if the $30 price tag is actually, you know, should I spend the 30 bucks or should I just wait for it to go on sale? I'm going to probably wait for it to go on sale because who has 30 bucks to spend on video games these days? But it is a thing. I've been looking uh, this past week at how I can try and set up like a drawing overhead camera type of view so that I can look at doing like drawing on stream and stuff like that. Or not on stream, but you know, videos. And I think I have a system that works. It cost me 25 cents, but I think it's worth the investment. Man, check this out. This village is terrifying now. <laughs> I bet from above this looks like absolutely... I should do an above view. I bet this looks at night. This has got to look friggin' epic. Alright. So this is going to herd the, uh, the pillagers into the water, isn't it? And they're going to come through the waterway. I think that's what's going to happen here. So the pillagers are going to attack and they're going to be immediately drawn towards the water because the water is the only place that they won't get their asses burnt up trying to get into the city. Yeah, simulator games are definitely where I have my strong suit because uh, just in general... I tend to do very well with uh, with those management type games. Like when I was playing Roller Coaster Tycoon, the uh, the first thing that I would always focus on is getting a positive cash flow and securing, you know, securing uh, securing investment. And once I was pretty much guaranteed to be making positive cash flow, then I would start looking at expanding. I don't know why, but I always just... First thing I focus on in a simulator game is finances, making sure that we're financially stable. I guess it's a good habit to have, because... Uh, that does tend to work out uh, favorably. Okay, here we go. We now have an O fence. We need to put some uh, some kind of drawbridge over that so we can jump our horse over the over the bridge. As for this, so yeah, that's that's this is good. This is this is really good. So if they try and get in by the the D fence they're going to get stopped by the O fence. But if the O fence doesn't stop them, the D fence will. Which leads us to the water entrance where we have the boat defense. 
if the pillagers do come and they decide to go by water because the water is the only direction that doesn't have a friggin fence that's going to kill them then they're going to have another thing coming because we've got that thing there so i guess i got to wonder if the if the pillagers come is it possible that they will spawn inside the village cuz we got a whole bunch of open space back here and if they spawn back here and that village is as good as toast. Like, no recovery, boy. Hang on a happen. Type of toast. So I guess it's it's an interesting it's an interesting concept. We'll have to see what happens with that. But in the meantime, holy crap, look at this. Let's see. This is going to be this is going to be the first real test of this system. Do I even have enough inventory space? I don't think so. Whatever, we'll give it a shot. And off we go and off we go and off we go and off. Let's go, let's go, all right. I like it, I like it. All right, this is looking good, this is looking good. So we're picking up massive amounts of sugar cane. We're gonna trade this for emeralds and XP. I like that it's kind of like a double bargain. You trade with the villagers and not only do you get emeralds, you get XP. And what do you do with that? You trade with villagers again to get more XP as well as cool stuff. It's a nice system. I like it. I like it. Alright, here we go. We're full, aren't we? Oh, we're very close to being full. Dirt. Uh, I don't need no gravel no more. Get rid of that gravel. Look at this. Stacks upon stacks of 64, and we haven't even collected it all. Alright, let's go. Let's see how much of it fell into the water. Look at this, look at this, look at this. We're friggin', we're completely full again. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? I'm gonna dispose of something. What can I get rid of? Ladders? Hold on. Ladders. Ladders. Uh. Hockey dokey then. Thanks a lot, Jack. What the hell just happened? Okay. Note to self. Crazy. Look at that. Look at that. We got three. Gotta note some of these really blast out the back there. Ten. Sixteen. There's not a lot that drops into the water. But this is certainly handy for collecting it. Okay, we're going to get another stack of sixty. Oh, no. no. I guess not. Got an extra twenty-six out of the, uh, out of the recollection system there. That's nice. Plenty of kelp. We should harvest that soon. But it's looking like we're getting close to the end of the episode. I'm the 404 guy, 7HE404GUI. Anemic as always. Feel free to subscribe, follow, etc. I don't get paid for this, so don't feel obligated to do so. But have yourselves a great day anyway. We'll see you all next time. And, uh. Yeah, I might be posting some, uh. Drawing videos on my. Ooh, hello. on my YouTube. So do stay tuned. And if you feel that this is social media worthy, feel free to share it on social media. Don't tell them I sent you, because... I haven't been... I haven't been able to do social media stuff with this channel very effectively. Oh, he's filling up. He's filling up. Come on. No, 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 no. Don't, don't mind me. 
don't mind me. Being a jerk. Okay, good. You're low on your prices, too. I like that. I like that. I like this guy. He speaks my language. He speaks the language of emeralds. Give me more. No. Fill up. Fill up. Go. Get over there. I'm bullying this poor librarian and like, just, come on, man. Give me stuff. Give me stuff. Don't make me kick your ass. Come on. Come on, dog. Get over there. Where's this guy? Where's the cartographer? Did he run away? Did he realize that I was bullying people and decided to run away in, in advance just to, to leave the poor librarian to have to deal with me? Is that what happened here? I feel like that's what happened. I got 14 emeralds. Dude, that's pretty good. What can I get for 14 emeralds? What do I... What do I... You... What the hell is that? That's a pie. I don't want no pie. You got sticks? Oh, you're the guy with the bell. It's kind of useless. Bricks? Sticks, bricks, and bells. You. Ah, these suck. You're so depressed, Fromaggio. Like you don't even know. You can get the iron back out of those, though, can't you? There's no uncrafting, sadly, but you can get iron ingots at least. Oi, cat! What's wrong with you? Why are you running like that? Silly cat. Anywho, that's it for the episode. Bye, everybody! What's this guy doing? Are you my cartographer? Are my stonemason? What is my mason doing stuck on a ladder? I just don't know. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait. I know I'm extending this beyond the natural length of what an episode should be, but I've got to see. How much XP do we get from this? Holy crap. That's actually doing really well. We went from 31 to 33. That's exactly what I wanted to do with this thing. Dude, that's freaking awesome. That is awesome positive note to end this episode on. Have a great day, everybody. Oh, my ear. What happened to my ear? Oh, my ear. It hurts so much. What I have done to my ear. It hurt. Why it hurts so much? What I did to my ear. Dude, that seriously hurts.